The 2015 iHeartRadio Awards kicked off in full gear last night, and we've got ourselves a hot list of all the star-studded winners. What's up, guys? Welcome back to Clever's Trophy Life, where we bring you the full recap of all things award show season. I'm your host, Dana Ward. So kicking off the night, and might I add, totally sweeping the iHeartRadio Awards with the most awards of the evening, the award for best lyrics went to Taylor Swift for her hit song, Blank Space. Taylor accepted her award after her idol, Justin Timberlake, jokingly headed to the stage before her, and due to the confusion of her catchy lyrics, she set a few things straight during her speech. Take a look. I would like to clarify that the line is actually, got a long list of ex-lovers. I don't know about you, but even knowing the lyrics to that song, I still hear Starbucks lovers. But while we're still on the T-Swift sweeping note, Taylor also took home the award for Song of the Year, which was Shake It Off, and we're totally not surprised, as the song is currently still in my head since last year. As for some newbies to the singing world, Sam Smith took home a much-deserved award in the Best New Artist category, along with new rock artist Hosier, who won the award for Alternative Rock Song of the Year for Take Me to Church. As for iHeart's other musical genre categories, newlywed country star Jason Aldean took home a lot more than his beautiful bride this month. He delivered a fiery performance of his hit song, Burning It Down, which also won the award for Country Song of the Year. The hip-hop rap song of the year went to Jeremiah featuring YG for Don't Tell Em. Oh, love that song. And dance song of the year went to Calvin Harris's anthem, Summer. And we're pretty sure that T-Swift was doing her own version of a happy dance when her new rumored beau nabbed the big trophy. So the first ever I Heart Music Renegade Award was given to country music star Brantley Gilbert for his emerging success and willingness to break the boundaries while staying true to himself. It seemed like Brantley was actually a little bit surprised, so even bigger congrats to the very talented musician. The Best Fan Army was given to the Australian Rockers of Five Seconds of Summer for their Five Sauce Fam super hard work and dedication, and if you listen closely, you can actually hear the screams of millions of Five Sauce fans around the world. <laughs> Whoa, hard work really does pay off, you guys. So the best collaboration for Bang Bang featuring Jesse J, Ariana Grande, and Nicki Minaj won its second collaboration award this weekend after nabbing a Kids' Choice Award as well. Although none of the fierce females were there to accept the award, Ariana did record a thank you on behalf of all of them. And ladies, if you're looking for a good workout, Ari totally delivered a big tip in her acceptance speech. And I'm so excited. I love you guys. Um, thank you so much. Um, okay, I'm gonna shut up now. Bye. By the way, this is really so heavy. Um, if any of you guys want to take this to the gym, I recommend it. And saving the biggest awards of the evening for last, we have Artist of the Year, which went to Taylor Swift, who is seriously slaying it at music and basically at life right now. Also, it seems like Justin Timberlake took home the iHeartRadio Innovator Award, and throughout the video that was put together for him, many of his biggest fans and supporters just showered him with praises and really, really kind, thoughtful words. Justin delivered a heartfelt speech quoting many famous leaders like Steve Jobs and Theodore Roosevelt, also saying that being different was a good thing, in which he thanks his mama, Timberlake. But he ended his speech thanking his, quote, best friend, favorite collaborator, and wife, Jessica, who is at home watching. Honey, I can't wait to see our greatest creation yet. Don't worry. Daddy's headed home right now to innovate by learning how to change a poopy diaper and get my swaddle on. Thank you all. Um, was that not the cutest end to an acceptance speech or what? Ugh, hashtag relationship goals. So guys, it is safe to say that they came, they saw, and they all slayed at the iHeart Music Awards. So what did you think about the night's winners? Let me know all of your thoughts in the comment section below, or you can tweet me, that's at Dana Ward online. And then you guys can click right over here to get a recap of the amazing duo that is Madonna and Taylor Swift at iHeart Radio Music Awards performance. It's all the same. Thanks so much for checking in with Clever's Trophy Life. I'm your host, Dana Ward. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, and I'll see you guys next time. And for more iHeart Awards show coverage, click to the left for a recap of Iggy and Jay Hudson's performance, and then click over to the right for a reminder of how hot Nick Jonas is during his performance of Chains.